Spellbound, and it's the magic of MCC is still not lost. Oh, it's a wonderful experience meeting all our old students. Oh, it's exciting. I couldn't imagine that something like this could happen. And it's wonderful meeting so many people down the years. And so, so very happy to see all my students doing so very well in life. After 30 years back to MCC, it feels awesome. It's really awesome to be here and spend time with my classmates and people that we love. Uh, this is probably the first time the late 90s and the 2000s have come. So it's fantastic. What? G.K. Matthew first met 59 years ago. I am a student of his, B.G. Koshi. Transformative, deep impact, star on the pantheon of English teachers.
Ja. I want to express my sincere thanks to them for organizing this function right. and for uh, receiving us with great affection. Right. We think of the old days. I thank all of these people who thought of this idea of alumni meeting. You know, that's wonderful. Otherwise, I wouldn't have met. And I fondly remember all the teachers who have come today and the teachers who have unfortunately left us. And I am what I am today uh, only because of uh, their, their amazing contribution to shape me as a personality and as a teacher. It's great coming back and great meeting the students. They have changed but we haven't. <laughs> we have reached the maximum level of change. <laughs> and it is evident the emotional um, togetherness and connect was so deep and so strong and we had a wonderful time in the morning. You made it uh uh, an occasion when you could felicitate some other teachers and uh, that was a good uh, uh, point which a trip down memory lane as mixed feelings uh, came flooding my memory meeting some of my own professors um, after so many years and some of my students who have done exceedingly well Nostalgic feeling for you? Yes, definitely. I have very pleasant memories of my stay here. I think I did most of my reading and, you know, the liberal reading. So, out here, so I think it's made a lot of difference. English department was, there were three missionaries. Uh -huh. McFile, Martin and uh, McNichol. All of them, English department. Each one had his own strengths. McPhail was an authority on Shakespeare. And then Martin was very good at 18th century mm -hmm. poetry. Jane Austen and all that sort of And then McTickle, he, he actually he mentored me in terms of you know, writing poetry. I still write poetry because of Reverend McTickle's right. teaching. I was here between 92 and 94 for my MA and then till 95 for my MPhil. MPhil, so you were also in the literature department? Yes, okay. I was a resident, I was part of the Heber Hall. Heber Hall. My classes were here, that side my first year yes. and this side for my second yeah, year. Oh, you passed out in 92?
So any institution which is not networking among the alumni would not stand on its own. It's very, very difficult. So keeping that in mind, we have now made it strategically possible that we would solicit our alumni to come back and enjoy this campus, not only enjoying the campus, at the same time, think about in what way you can contribute to this, the, your alma mater, in various possible ways. <laughs> I Hello. was here in 2006 to 11. Oh, very good. Both your masters and undergrad, is it? Very good. Okay. I think we were here only for one year together, uh -huh. and it and it so happened in that one year. <laughs> yeah. And so it didn't start at the gutters and end at the gate. Ah, uh, no. It was from the woods to the altar, and <laughs> hopefully till forever. <laughs> my wife is, wife is my wife is 2002. For us, it's extra special to come back because she used to study. Right here, her classes were, and I, I lived yeah. in Selly Hall. So, how's that for a story? <laughs> Love story. Fantastic story. Yes, and great culture. It has uh, stayed the same, is what I can see. Yes, my husband's name is Bila. We did UG together. PG was a senior to me one year because I did my BA and then joined here. And my best half, Samson Cook, is from Max Department and he's from MCC. It's good to be here. I'm coming back after 20 years. So. It's very nostalgic. You know, all those lovely memories of us being together and no worries at all. It's so, I mean, I don't even want to leave actually. It's so nice. So could you please make it fast before the next shower? Proud, proud to be an MCCN, and uh, we really miss those memorable days and just cherishing the moments. <laughs> <laughs> we had a nice time yeah, together after a long time. It's been 30 years since we left the college, and it's, it was a wonderful time. You know, the 30 years have just you know disappeared the minute we entered here. Kanyan is my classmate, in fact. Kanyan, great, you could make it. Yeah. How does it feel to be back on the campus? Yeah, it's nice. It's nice. It's, it's a rememberable day. Right. And you brought your wife. Yeah. Introduce us to your wife. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Best thing liked about this? Meeting my professors after a long time. We had a very great chance to show our gratitude. Mm. I taught here for some time. I continue to be associated in various academic capacities. But nothing like feeling like a student back here. <laughs> Though we missed a few of them, they who are no more. But it's great meeting our professors. I really miss uh, Professor Bhatt and uh, Professor Doraisa, uh, Professor Rajani. Yeah, the faculty, they are very caring. They are so compassionate. Uh, along with their level of intellectuality. And I met all my friends, my seniors, my professors. To be or not to be, that is the question. Whether it is who would bear the whips and scorns of life, the opponent's wrong, the pangs of despised love. Uh, theatre has, from being an extracurricular one, it has started to come into the curriculum now, and I think that's a <clears throat> that's where I think Rajani's contribution uh, comes into the mainstream <laughs> now. Theater.
So MCC has really done so much for everyone. And uh, this was a moment of reflection, true reflection, and it was so authentic. You're incorporating new areas in terms of specializations or electives? Yeah, we have done a lot. Uh, now we are in the process of uh, revising. Uh, so medical humanities, disability studies, music and literature, and uh, uh, theater and literature. It's truly amazing and inspiring, uh, especially we were able to see a generation of students being grateful to their professors. We are able to see how much a teacher can impact a student's life.